I just want to encourage you to keep standing in faith. If it's ever a time that we need to stand in faith, it's right now. Remember this, that when the earth, and back in Noah's day, Noah had the faith to float a boat when the whole world was in liquidation. <laughs> and uh, so it's no different today. We've got to stand in faith. And we're teaching the kids in the inner city about faith. And we're teaching them to hold on to God's word. And here's some scriptures uh, for you to comfort yourself with during these crazy times we live in. There's Isaiah 54, 17. Uh, Isaiah 53, verses 4 and 5. Uh, there's uh, Joshua chapter 1, verses 8 and 9. 1 Peter 2, 24. Then there's Psalms 90, uh, 91. And Psalms 23. These are just some scriptures that I find comforting that I read that uh, helps me get through the day. Alrighty? And we teach the kids in the inner city these important scriptures from God's Word. We teach them God's Word all the time. We're out there on the, on the property. We're laying hands on the kids, imparting an end-time anointing on these kids. And I know many of them don't understand that, but that's okay. All right? It's a spiritual thing. We're imparting this end-time anointing upon these kids to be able to hear the Word, receive the Word, live the Word, do the Word, and stand strong in their neighborhoods for Christ. And many of you have helped us continue to do that. We're gonna keep putting out the gospel. We're gonna keep doing everything we possibly can. But if it's ever a time that Cynthia and I and Metro City Kids need your help, it's now. How do, you say, how do, you, how do, we, how do we help you? It's very simply. Here's my website, metrocitykids.us. You can help us by making a very generous donation. You know, Cynthia and I don't pastor a church. We can't go and stand up in front of the congregation and say, this week we want to take up an offering for all the kids so that we can do this and that and whatever. We don't, we don't have that ability. So as an evangelist, I bring my need before God. I pray to Him and I ask Him to anoint the words that I'm saying to you right now because you are our congregation. So we come to you. And I believe in God to touch your heart, to speak to your heart, that you'll help us. God uses people. He always has and always will. Would you allow him to use you to help our ministry? MetroCityKids.us. On the homepage at the top, you'll see it says Donate. Boop. Click on the Donate tab and watch what God will do. He'll bless you for it. Because the Bible says as you reach out to the poor and you give to the poor and the ministries to the poor, God's going to pour it back to you. All right? He really will. As you cast your bread upon the water, it'll come back to you. Given it shall be given to you, pressed down, shaken together, shall men give unto your bosom. Remember those verses. I know sometimes uh, we get out there with the kids and uh, it, it seems like sometimes nobody's listening, but I, in, inevitably I have kids come up and hug me and they'll say, Uncle Sam, Pastor Terry, thank you for bringing that message to us today. Well, did you learn something? I sure did. And they'll tell me what they learned. And we go over the memory verse with the kids. It's a joy. And I want to say thank you for pushing us further down the road to keep us out there. No matter what's happening in the world today, no matter what's going on, we've got to keep ministering to these children who are in these public housing sites. So please go to our website, metrocitykids.us, click on the donate tab, and let me hear from you immediately, if not sooner. Here, give me, give me a high five, bam, if you're gonna help me. Here, I'll give it to you one more time. Bam, high five, all right? God bless you and we are praying for you. We're believing God to meet all your needs and to keep you safe and healthy. You do the same for, for Pastor Cynthia and I. And uh, man, we love you. You're the best, all right? And thank you. And if you ever get to Jacksonville, contact me. You can come out with us and we can do ministry together. God bless you and thank you for watching this video.